Welcome back everyone. We're minutes away from the cheapest VW bus I can find on Facebook Marketplace. I actually didn't even find this bus. Dubworks and a friend of mine, Chris, sent me this listing. Of course I jumped on it. $500 VW bus. How bad is it? Let's go find out. That wasn't the road. Oh, I turned early. I turned Proceed early. to the route. Yeah, I'm trying. I got a trailer. Proceed to the route. Oh boy. I'm already Proceed lost. To the route. Yeah, okay. Trying. Proceed to the route. All right. Damn. Proceed to the All route. Right. Try my backing up skills. Oh, I just jackknifed the bejesus out of this thing. There goes my directions. We're off to a good start. I can tell you nobody was finding this bus. Did he say on the right? It's not good up there. Oh, there it is. I saw this for sale on the island. So it's from Long Island? Yeah, so the guy... It is, it is I'm pretty sure, a Long Island bus. The guy... Uh, it was about a church, you said, right? Yeah, so there was a church with a bunch of old vehicles. And the guy lives next to as long island has this road with junkyards on it I'm giving you the long-winded story here but i think he had a business where he would buy and sell cars okay so somebody told him about there was like a 1950s car parked next to this so he bought both vehicles gotcha And the kids smashed out all the windows. Yeah, so the, yeah and I, that's, uh, sadly, I think he got vandalized a little bit. Yeah. Toe hitch. Yeah. <laughs> it's got the original spare cover in there. That's yeah. cool. Rear seat. Looks like it needs a little bit of a wire, uh, maybe a little bit of work on the wiring. Well, you know, I took the dash out. <laughs> Did of you? I started to, like, disassemble it. As, and as it was actually a lot of work. Okay. As most of us do, we start to disassemble. Yeah, and <laughs> I know. And and I thought the windshield rust on mine was bad. <laughs> That's what's gonna happen when I pull the windshield out of mine. It's gonna look uh, even worse than yeah. that. Mine's rusted all the way down here. What year bus again? 69. Oh, 69. But I mean if you put a new nose on this, you know. But well, let me get the you. Roof is good. I'm not kidding. That yeah, the roof is, is good. Uh, so has the body tag. That's good. Corners are gone as usual. The dash is back there. Horn button's still on. Look at that. <laughs> no key. No, no, no key. Of course, they took the emblem. We did get the front bumper. I didn't even notice Art pointed out they cut the wheel wells. I didn't even notice that. Well, we lost our tour rescue guide. Oh, my JMC. Can't have that getting wet. Sixty-eight. Is that velvet green? I don't know if they made it on the uh, low light bay windows. Say it with me, low light bay windows. Yes, I lube this regularly. <laughs> Doesn't any of your stuff work? <laughs> Love you guys. Who's gonna steer? Is this thing roll? Oh, I think it's gonna roll. Nice, probably in gear. The heavy stuff's not supposed to come down for another hour or two, so we should be good. I might actually be lined up. Um, is it in gear? I'm thinking it's not. Parking brake on. She's a roller, I think. Don't do it. Don't. Don't do it. 
Feels pretty sturdy. Don't do it. Oh, he's gonna do it, isn't he? He's gonna hook onto that. Don't do it. I'm sorry. You guys are gonna have to endure this with me. You're gonna put yourself right under this little drip drip a -roo right here. Yeah, right right there. Oh, that feels good. Right on the neck. Oh, right on the back of the neck. Right where I like it. Oh, yeah. Oh, that was refreshing. What'd you do with the battery? This is from Don's place. I couldn't leave him all the junk, so. Uh oh, I'm gonna have to give this a steroid jerk. I'm gonna have to put you down. Stay. Yeah! Here's a quick tip on why your Harbor Freight winch died. Because the cables are junk. Even with a battery post and a good battery, the cables turn to powder. Our tour guide made the right move going inside. We're gonna break out the wireless one today just for the commenter that said I should have a wireless set up, which I do. Oh, there it is. Okay. Yeah, it doesn't really work that way. No, no. Let's try that again, shall we? See, look, wireless, I can stand back. She's a roller. Seriously? Wow. Whose idea? Oh my God, seriously? <laughs> oh, you gotta love it. What in the hell? I'm glad I didn't rip the bumper off. Okay, so maybe this is turning into a rescue video. Maybe. Is that actually hooked? You gotta be kidding me. Tell me that's not hooked. <laughs> no. Alright. Got it. I did find boards, so let's try the boardage. She's a roller, so we don't have to worry about dragage. You know, even gutted, these buses, they really are heavy. Err, than a needle. I just gotta say, in my experience. I told Josh, this would be a piece of cake. I just gotta winch it home and I'll be home to see you on our new business endeavor. And yes, it involves Volkswagens. I like it. All right, take two. Thank you again to the commenter because I'm glad I grabbed this. Because this is making this much easier. Check that other side. Oh, she's sliding off a little bit. Yeah. Still steers nice. Slick board, no problem. Sitting. Sitting 117 years, look at that, it worked, it, it worked its way right into the asphalt. Oh, see, now we're coming off on this side, straighten her out. Watch for wires, you can be killed. No, nothing but rain. If this falls off, it's gonna be bad. I just moved the ramp over a little bit. 
gonna be go slow. Don't you slide. Oh, we're mo we're we're money on this side. Get rid of our boards. Check our alignment, looking pretty good. Just pull this slack. Well, that's it. This door actually closed. I think this door, I've done that. Don't do that. That's, you shouldn't do that. Let's hope this stays the way it is on the way home. I, I will do that. It's got the original. Oh, we got some rot. Cam two only. Gotcha. How is the frame? Doesn't look terrible. Terrible, there's that terrible word again. Why am I still out in the rain? That's a great question. It's too late, we're soaked. Typical. All right, I'll crawl under it when we get home. I should just, you know what? I'm already soaked. What am I gonna do? Come out, crawl under it when I'm home and changed and dry? Well, I guess I could do it tomorrow. How's the beam? You guys see in there? Front frame looks. You can't see in there. All right, that's a wrap. I strap it down. We're out of here. Oh, we had a little washout there. Yeah, just one more thing of mine that's broken. Dang it! Will you put wipers on the tundra? Of course, now it's not raining. So, but we got it. Hopefully that frame's good. We'll see. We'll see tomorrow. I'll check back with you guys tomorrow when it's sunny. It's much better. Much better. Is it a keeper? Well, that depends on this. Ho, ho, ho! Not too shabby. Wow. That slide's really nice. Considering. So what do we have in here? I've, I've been dying to get a look at this destroyed de Oh, there's no speed on the agent before. Uh oh, we got a radio. What does that say? All transition. Oh, we got one hell of a mouse nest in there. Good news right there, that's not all mouse chewed on. The uh, 69 iron behind us isn't so fortunate. Cigar ashtray, cigarette lighter. Well, I'm glad we have this at least. I have an extra one of these in the basement. Rear torsion area looks good. Drum roll. You and I are looking at this for the first time. Cross members are always a little roach, but man, that frame looks good. Well, I can see. Tell you what, guys, this bus is pretty solid. Considering, I know. I know you California guys are cringing right now. I say solid and then we see stuff like this. What's living in there? Mmm. Oh, that's... Jan's gonna be happy about that. 
It is velvet green. It's missing a lot. It needs a lot. It does have a body tag. Hmm. Good door panel. Inside, no, he didn't break the inside one. That's good. Oh, what do we have growing in there? Hmm. What are you thinking? Original paint? I mean, this looks like original paint to me. You know, I'm going to have to just buff it and just, you know, leave it in the yard. But look at that green. I love original paint. So that's a no on the will it run. If you didn't know, there's a panel there and the gas tank comes out through the engine compartment. Apron comes out here. Very easy on, well, except for the bay windows because you got to support the tranny when you take the engine out. Battery tray is gone. Typical. But look at that velvet green. Yeah, it's going to take a lot of green to bring this one back. You get covered in rust. So no spare tire. That's cool. I like those. Uh-oh. Oh, good. I was worried there. We got our other Ford Galaxy slash VW bus. Barrette. Oil bath cooler. Some groovy carpet. Yeah, that's that's not good. But not rotted right in here. It's so weird how some of these rot. They all rot right where the battery is. But no, I did not pull from the uh, tow hitch. Well, you know what I'll be doing today. I'm gonna clean this thing out. I won't bore you with that. There's nothing. <laughs> I'm already boring you. Looks wet up there in that corner though. I'm thinking this is original paint and if it is, it's really cool. I do dig. I just, who doesn't love original paint? But look at it, it's wasted. Who cares? It's original paint. Let's get a look at these M codes. <laughs> no? Unlocked. Oh. <laughs> Ouch. All right, well, here's our M codes. Velvet green, baby. Velvet green. Love this color. So, guys, I don't know how well you can see this. We are on vw-mplate.com. We are decoding our M-plate. Make sure you are on your model. This is a 68, so we're on the 68, 69, type 2, obviously, bay window. I punched in all the information on my M-code plate right here. Uncode my M-code plate. Scroll down. Here's our information. Do you see velvet green, L512? I do see Westphalia Camp Mobile. I saw the Jealousy windows. I don't know why I'm surprised by that. It says it was picked up by the first owner at the factory in Germany, meant for the US market. Here's where it gets a little more interesting. We see our A67, that's an SO67 Westphalia Camp Mobile interior. So perhaps my interior is missing. It's hard to tell. These come you know different interior setups but nothing else too crazy on here I thought I'd see the bumper overriders I don't see them you see them got like 69 Ford Galaxy um, overriders so that's it something to check out if you've never seen that before it's pretty cool
tell you what, you put a set of grabbers, roof rack, pop coat, panes of glass, someone's gonna give you 10 grand for this bus. You think I'm crazy? Original paint. All right, let's go have a look at the oval. And, uh, cause I gotta get an oval update for you this weekend. All right, it's much cooler back here. I've been dumping Marvel, ATF, filling the cylinders every day. Six point socket. Haven't gone full on uh, extension on this thing yet. Needs time, like most of you say. You can hear it jig, jostling around in there. So I went ahead and marked it just in case. It looked like we had some movement, but I went ahead and marked it. We've got nothing still. Why don't you just drop the engine? Well, I'll tell you what. This thing was in the ground for, what was it, 40 years? 40? You remember the 1955 oval engine removal? The lower case studs were nuclear seized into the aluminum transmission, so. That was a two day event, a lot of destruction on that one. So really, 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 yes, it, just because you get it freed up, it's not gonna be a good running engine. However, I'd like to at least get it freed up. It helps sell the dream, the hope, okay? So that's why I'm doing what I'm doing. So hopefully we'll have an update on this on Saturday. Guys, Dubworks came out to check out the 68 bay window. Yeah. He just made some interesting observations. Yeah. We ran the M codes. I sent him the M codes. What do you got for us? Picked up by the owner at the factory. Camp mobile, but not a fancy camp mobile. Um, had something about um, like seatbelt writing for England and Ireland. Uh, unparasited engine whatever that means and with the westy with the westy interior it's a basic camp mobile but what's strange is that it's got the westy roof and you can see the remains of some of the wood paneling but it's got a deluxe bench seat deluxe trim panels up front it's got jail bars which are really a deluxe thing you never see that on a westy the step is cool though the steps so maybe when they just chucked that seat in there, they, they went ahead and these. put this paneling in. But you were, possible. you were looking at the. There's covers here. You see there's these covers, and I don't think campers have those. Mine doesn't. The seventy one that I've had didn't. I feel like that's a deluxe thing too, because the deluxe you're supposed to be able to walk through, and it's like a padding. Yeah. Between the walkthrough. Oh. Okay. Campers don't have that. They're okay. just painted. What would be interesting is if under this, if it's fully painted, that would be telling, but I don't know if they actually cared or not. Well, you we can see right here. It's... Right here it's painted, but like up top, cause these are, this would be, so that's, that's another thing hole? too. That's for the oh, full so that's, ventilation. Yeah, so this is not the original panel then. Well, but they didn't, yeah, it's true. So they put in the deluxe. They could have put those in, but it's got grab handles, two grab handles, which is interesting, they and could... coat hooks. They could have screwed all that in though, off the yeah, other bus. It's true, because it does have the hooks for the front cot. Now, all this fun stuff. Now that could explain where the crazy beam came from. That could be where the crazy beam came from. That could be from, well this would have to be bay window stuff. I don't know what year, but that could be the crazy beam. Cause when you look at the beam, it's not the right beam cause it's not held in with anything. It's got, you know, one bolt on each, yeah, it's got one bolt on this side and one bolt on the other side. Yeah, not good. Not good, not safe for the road. Would not pass an inspection. It's very interesting. Very, o very overall, cool. you're pretty happy overall, with it. Overall, this is a nice, good buy. And it's cool. And I like, I, I, I like the color too. Velvet green is a good color. I love the velvet green. And speaking of that, looking at the brochures for set, uh, 68, I don't really see velvet Did green. Did you get those brochures from me? No. Well, yes, I have <laughs> brochures from you. It probably is a 68 one, actually. I'm going to need those back. <laughs> We're going to need to research. I don't see velvet green as an option, at least here. Really? I see Because it's got white, the sticker. red. Yes, and there's a green and white deluxe 
option, I think. Huh. Maybe it was Neptune Blue in the picture was green. But I didn't see a green. You normally see it on split windows. So, but they are around. So it's interesting. Very interesting. All right. Special order. Well, there you have it. This is a special bus. It's got Delbrook's stamp, stamp of approval. Yes. What did I say? What did I say when you went to go pick it up? Oh, it's going to be something special, like they picked it up at the factory. Did yeah. you? Yeah. Yeah, oh. you can go back. Hey, you the, nailed it. For the record. So, and a special thank you to Delbrook's for sending me this, and Chris as well. Chris was later than you. I think you got him by about yeah. 20 minutes. Well, you know, I'm always browsing. You get the big commission prize. <laughs> More free rent at the shop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm all wondering these, how long it was in Europe. All these stickers are in all German. All these stickers are German. That's German. That's German. This is a Deutschland sticker. Yeah, you know. That I didn't, one I didn't, I didn't walk over there. That's an American flag, so I don't think that counts. But those ones are German. Yeah, I didn't even notice. I, I yeah. managed to avoid them with the power washer, though, so I did save them. Good. Check the door out. They're special. Oh, I didn't. I didn't break it. You didn't do that. I did not do it. Are you lying? I am not lying. It was on video documented that it was already broken, because I broke both of his door handles. Pre broke. Pre broke. Yeah. I don't even know how to open these. Mine doesn't. Down. Have, mine doesn't have a thing. <laughs> You're giving me a hard time. Wow. So at least it works, right? Wow. Yeah. Wow. What are we doing? <laughs> Original paint. Let's see Original it. Original paint. Let's do it. Let's make sure we're all the way up. might be oh there's a green coming off this might be this is pretty oxidized is it yeah this might need a few passes you're pretty brave holding that towel right there next to your orbital pad that, that's true that was a that's a risky move show us what you're using there so this is griot's correcting cream it's not meant for this level of oxidation i, I think i have mcguire's uh, do you yeah. what do you have 105 yeah that's meant for this level of oxidation all right we're back with we're back with Ultimate compound, which is my compound of choice. It smells good too. Is it that does. the cinnamon stuff? It doesn't smell like cinnamon no matter what you no? say. No? What? It's, no, you say it smells like cinnamon. Do I? Yeah. Oh, totally it's cinnamon. No cinnamon. There. Smell that. I. <laughs> cinnamon. There's no cinnamon there. Not really that big of a difference. This paint's real. Well, no, no, huge. Yeah, that's you a big, think it's a big yeah, difference? Yeah, that's a big difference. That's yeah. deeper. And, yeah. yeah. This is like. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, way. Yeah. yeah. So we'll just do the whole thing now. I'm going for the win with uh, McGuire's. With McGuire's. This well, you called it. You said your stuff wasn't really cut out. It's not cut for the heavy. It's for the heavy, heavy. Yeah. How's that pad? This pad also is getting. Yeah. The sports bug did this pad. Yeah. So. It's not, it's not bad. It's a nice color. It's a great color. All right, guys, that's going to do it for me. Thanks for dropping in, checking out the $500 Facebook Marketplace bus. Hopefully have an update for you on the Oval on Saturday. Also, Sunday, Musty One, 99.9% .9 sure, is coming down. Him and I are going to head over to the Connecticut Volkswagen Association show in Terryville. I believe it's Terryville. Look it up, Connecticut Volkswagen Association. Make it a great week, and we'll see you soon. Take care, guys. And maybe see us at the show. Go to the show.